Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you the new features that were added in the FM WhatsApp update, the version uh, the version 9.25. So if I go to phone mode and I go for updates, I'm going to be explaining all of this. I'm going to be explaining all of this and the first one is copy caption feature for media images slash video you can copy a caption for a video for a status i'm going to show you that and the next feature is ability to search web or use emojis as your profile pic i'm also going to show you how that works then i show you the reaction feature that's a good one and i'm liking that very much the reaction feature i'm going to show you how it works plus i'm going to show you the pause and resume voice not recording that is an interesting one this one and i'm glad it was added it's a good feature and it's quite useful then another one i'm going to show you is the privacy setting uh, and this privacy setting for contacts except which can see your last scene and your profile photo it's also nice because it wasn't available back then so without wasting time let me show you how each and everyone works so uh, i'm going to first go for the copy caption for media and videos so for example if i go to my statuses and uh, i'm going to look for one of the statuses like let me say here i like this so if i want to copy the caption for for this uh for this video just the caption uh, i can download the function when you place here you get many options one is the save this one will download the status but this one this one is the one that was added this one it's the one that was added and it's quite good so right now if i place on copy caption it will just copy the caption for the status so if i come and maybe i place here and I paste. So you see, I've pasted the caption that was on that video. So that's one of the functions that was added to the new update. And the next function was the ability to use an emoji as your profile pic. It was the second function, the ability to set an emoji as your profile pic. So if I go to settings and I go to profile pic, then I place on here. So you see, I can use an emoji, emoji or sticker as my DP. So I will show you if I place on that, I can place on this. So I can use this as my DP. So you just place here. So you just place on this to save and it will just be your DP. You can use an emoji, you can use stickers, you can go through your stickers and you can use any, any sticker as your DP. You can use any sticker, any emoji as your DP, and that's quite nice. Uh, then, if we go on another function, the reaction function. So, that's quite interesting. Like, for example, I can react to this message. Maybe I can send a thumbs up. I made a video on this. You just long press on the message, and you just react on it. I can send a heart. Uh, and the other person will receive that message. For example, you see... Uh, if I place here, I can see the reaction. Here is the reaction. If I send a message to another person, that's the reaction you get. And it's quite a good feature that was added. Then another feature that was added that I'm more interested in, it's the pause and resume audio. For example, let me show you. If I'm to send an audio, you just place here and you send. Maybe let me say hello how are you ah, so i've recorded this audio i've said hello how are you and i've paused it so if i play it you listen to it and you send maybe let me say hello how are you so i can also add on to this voice note what i can do is just place on this red just place on this mic and i can add on my recording without putting on a new recording so let me add on the recording i wanted to know how your night was 
and now if i may pause and i play this audio you will see it's a continuation of my audio that i was sending and you send maybe let me say hello how are you i wanted to know how your night was so you see that's something good you can add on your audios so you can add on your audios and you don't need to record multiple audios you can just you know save one audio and keep on continuing to record on it if you're doing something maybe someone interrupted you can just pause it you talk to them after talking to them you resume the audio you add on where you had stopped this is quite something good and it's i say it's very helpful because it's applicable most times you're recording an audio and you're interrupted you can't add on it you have to record a new audio all you do is just pause it and you add on after doing whatever you're doing so mm-hmm. that's quite a nice feature also and the last feature that is very nice that i am really liking is the new privacy feature so if i go to settings to act to uh, to get it you just go to settings you go to accounts then you go to privacy and here it is so last time this feature wasn't there this part wasn't there now you can set who will see your profile pic for example if i set here and i choose three contacts i've already made before contacts and i take so after it updates it will show you profile pic four contacts excluded those four contacts won't be able to see my profile pic and that was a good touch that was a variable but only on the statuses and also my last scene i can exclude some people from seeing my last scene some people won't be able to see when i was online i can maybe get to contacts and save you see it shows last scene two contacts excluded and this was a good touch so if you want to maybe some people you don't want them to see your profile pic or you don't want them to see when you're online you're hiding maybe from some people or some people are disturbing you all you do is just come and exclude them from seeing your last scene they won't see when you're online or when you're offline they won't be able to uh, see your profile pic and to add on that if you want to go fully incognito let me first reactivate this if you want to go fully incognito what you do to add on that for example if i want this person to you know not see my last scene my profile all you do is just place on it and you go to custom privacy you can also activate all these they won't be able to see your blue ticks the second tick the microphone as a recording hide view status hide everything will be you'll be totally incognito to those person and they won't be able to see any of you unless you want to talk to them or you want to reply them but if they send a message they won't tell if you're online or you're offline and those are the functions that we added in the new fm whatsapp and they are quite interesting quite good quite applicable anyway guys thanks for watching and hope this was quite a fun video and nice video see you next time